I'm going to talk today about synchronized threaded processing. It is a radically different method that changes, at the system level, the way Rampage processes files. The main reason for this change is the prevalence of transparent effects used by graphic artists. Because the PostScript language does not render transparency accurately, prepress operators must input PDF files into the Rampage workflow. Because these files are much more complex and larger than PostScript, they can degrade processing speed. As a result, transparency from popular layout packages can dramatically challenge older system configurations. To appreciate how things have changed in Rampage version 12, let's first take a look at the way it worked in the past. Up to and through version 11, Rampage was constrained by older operating systems. Whether one or two RIP applications were running on a workstation, and regardless of the number of processing cores on that workstation, there was a one-to-one-to-one -one -one relationship. What I mean by that is a single page used a single RIP, and that single RIP used a single processor. The big difference in version 12 is the ability to take advantage of how Windows 7 uses RAM across the eight processing cores that now ship with Rampage workstations. Specifically, it allowed our engineers to dedicate four processing cores to a single page and use the remaining cores for other workflow tasks such as pre-flighting or screening. Ultimately, how it works is less important than how much faster it works. First, I want to point out that all testing was done using Rampage PDF Trap Engine. The test suite included a 36-page brochure and, more importantly, several large format projects. If you focus on this first matrix, you'll see a big jump in speed when moving from version 10 to either version 11 or 12. According to this chart, the software, independent of the hardware, is about 60% faster. Next, let's say you keep your software version the same but swap to the new Firecore workstation. This will roughly double your RIP speeds. The most interesting number is the compound effect of running version 12 on the Firecore workstation. For example, as shown here, there's a jump of more than 500% as compared to running version 10 on dual 3.2 Xeons. In summary, version 12, when run on a Rampage Firecore workstation, can use four processing cores to RIP a single file. This system level change can improve throughput by anywhere from 80 to more than 500 percent, depending on your current configuration.